What's up everyone? Uh, I'm going to do my review of GTA Grand Theft Auto 3. Uh, this game is like one of those old gen games that I got for my PS4 Pro. Uh, you have GTA 3 and GTA Vice City. Well, for people who don't know, sorry, Grand Theft Auto 3, Grand Theft Auto Vice City, and Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Uh, I already played Grand Theft Auto San Andreas on the Xbox One when it uh, was backwards compatible for the 360, which I had when I used to have my pad when I used to have an Xbox 360, which I will uh, get the one review of Grand Theft Auto, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas on Wednesday, so be on the lookout for that. But I'm just gonna say what I didn't like about this and get it out of the way. What I didn't like about Grand Theft Auto 3 was that the main protagonist, I forget what his name is because I really didn't pay attention, as uh, he doesn't talk. Uh, I think there's probably gonna be some music that he talks and then talks. The main protagonist, this dude I'm playing as, doesn't talk. Uh, when you die, all your weapons are gone, you have to go get them. Plus body armor. Uh, you can't look into the map to where you're going to place a waypoint, you have to look at that. GTA games is, you know, place a waypoint and all that. I'm warning you. Like, you go into the map and you place a waypoint where you want to go in the destination. You follow the, de the destination. And I'm going to show you guys the cutscene. The cutscene plus the final mission, what you have to do. I did use cheats. I don't usually use cheats in these old gen Grand Theft Auto games. Like, San Andreas, Vice City, and whatever. I only do it like for the final boss, you know. Anyway. And just to let everyone know, I don't use cheats all the time. Because, like, I'm a, like, I'm a okay gamer and stuff. And I'm pretty good at, at the game when I play and all that. Because, you know. Because I take my time and analyze the situation before you go. Que es idiot, one of these scar face idiots.
The real question is, did you turn up to rescue Maria or to get me back? Well, I got news for you. Shooting you will be a pleasure, but dating you was only business. You are muy pequeñito, amigo. Throw over the cash. You have been a busy boy, but you haven't learned. I'm not to be trusted. Kill the idiot! Alright, so, Grand Theft Auto 3, I give this game a 9 out of 10, usually I give games 10 out of 10 that I like, I did like this, I did like this game, but with the problems, like the, because it's an old gen game, you can't really complain about it, but, yeah, I give this game a 9 out of 10. Usually I give games a 10 out of 10 because it's a masterpiece and a work of art. But this is an old gen game, so I give this game a 9 out of 10. And, uh, yeah. So, Rockstar, you did a good job with this game. But, like, if you guys want to play this game, just, uh, make sure you know where everything is at. game because like I had to like explore but if you really want to get a Grand Theft Auto game like go have a blast from the past I recommend pretty much pretty much this game Vice City and um GTA San Andreas. G GTA San Andreas, man. Whew, that takes me back. Pretty much takes anybody back from the good old days. If you ask my friends who are maybe three, like, yeah, who are my subscribers, they would tell you that GTA San Andreas is a blast from the past that they pretty much one of their favorite games probably yeah so GTA San Andreas GTA 3 GTA Vice City or if you don't want to get Vice City you can just get GTA Vice City and GTA San Andreas plus GTA 5 so yeah that, this is my review I'll talk to y'all later peace out
Bone!